Hey everyone! In today's video we will be discussing why gold and silver prices have fallen sharply over the past couple of weeks. This is in contrast to what usually happens during an economic crisis when precious metals like gold and silver tend to maintain their value as investors tend to see these assets as a safe haven for their capital. So let's get into it. Both gold and silver prices have fallen drastically over the past couple of weeks, as you can see on the screen at the moment. Both assets have also been seeing massive intraday movements due to the increased volatility in the markets. Gold in particular seems to have become the asset of choice for investors to generate cash. What this means is that investors have been selling their gold position to hold cash on hand instead. We saw a very similar movement during the 2008 financial crisis. However, as soon as central banks started announcing stimulus packages and the interest rates were cut, this started to reassure the market and then investors started buying back into gold. This led to the gold price appreciating and doubling over the coming weeks and months. So I do think it's likely that we'll see something very similar happen here, especially now that the US Fed, the Bank of England and the ECB have cut their interest rate to close to zero and announced various stimulus packages. With silver, there is another fundamental reason as to why the price has fallen so drastically. This is because for silver, 60% of the demand for silver comes from industrial fabrication demand. Companies like Volkswagen, Toyota, Apple and Samsung make up the majority of this demand. And all of these companies have been severely impacted by supply chain shortages and forced plant foreclosures during the pandemic. At the same time, industrial production of silver hasn't halted as producers in both Mexico and Peru didn't have any incidents and didn't have to close their plants. Therefore, there has been a imbalance in supply and demand for silver. At the moment, we have an oversupply and a shortage of demand, causing the price to have fallen so drastically. Again, now that various central banks have announced their stimulus packages, if this starts to reassure the market, I do believe that investors will start buying back into silver, especially since it is such a good buying opportunity at the very cheap price at the moment. This will then rebound its price back to market. So there we have it. This is what has been happening to both gold and silver at the moment. Do leave me any questions in the comment section down below and I'll see you in the next one.